hey y'all welcome to my channel so today we are doing the birthday prep so it is monday my birthday brunch is on sunday so in six days and also my birthday is on a tuesday not tomorrow but next tuesday so i have a while for my actual birthday but that don't even matter because technically well not technically but really my birthday is on sunday because i'm seeing everybody on sunday we celebrating on sunday so that's really my birthday but technically my birthday is on tuesday anyways let's start this video off with bad news i ain't got nothing to wear y'all nothing at all so i need to go find something to wear i ordered some stuff and try to support some black owned businesses no shade but my stuff ain't here so we are going to head to zara at this point because I don't know like what's going on I don't know one of them did come and it just wasn't what I really expected so I had to send it back to exchange it because they don't accept returns and that won't be here until after my birthday so yeah everything I looked for and liked also a lot of stuff was sold out a lot of stuff was on pre-order and so after my birthday date it would arrive like just or even the brand didn't even drop like summery spring stuff so yeah i don't know if you guys know about hanifa i was really 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 excited when they said they were dropping a collection and they dropped it it was like a lot of fall stuff and i was like it's spring sis like where are the sleeveless things like everything was long sleeve everything was like knit material and i was like okay this is really cute sis you did that but what's going on and i was finding out with a lot of different brands too like a lot of brands just haven't dropped anything yet and i'm just like where y'all at i need a birthday outfit don't y'all know it's my birthday well they probably don't clearly but don't y'all know it's my birthday i need an outfit okay and i specifically wanted to wear an outfit where that brand what they sell is their original design so i didn't want anybody to custom make me anything but just like good example hanifa she designs all of her pieces everything that she sells is not wholesale she that's completely her original idea design etc you know what i mean so i wanted to support um different brands in their original design but unfortunately things just did not play out the way i really thought it was going to so we're gonna go to zara but this is what i'm wearing i've been wearing this kind of all day but i just threw on this jacket and then also these slides from lux to kill so let's start from the top to the bottom excuse the dishwasher necklace is from anna luisa this is the adam bold necklace this jacket is from top shop i got it really really long time ago so i don't know if they still have it but it's a basic so i'm pretty sure they should right i don't know why not these joggers are from Zaful, which I don't really recommend them, but whatever. Um, they're hiked up like this for a reason, okay? They shrunk and now they're literally capris. Um, I'm wearing some like little Nike socks and then also these little fake Yeezy slides from Lux to Kill. And then I'm probably gonna throw on the good old Balenciaga bag. So this doesn't really match, but it's gonna match today, okay? Everything's already in this bag, so. I don't even need to go searching. All right, we're pretty much at the mall. And now I need to find a parking spot. Ooh, it's dark. Hello. Brighten up. There we go. I cannot wait to get a new car because this little backup camera is not it. Y'all, I'm actually excited for whatever reason to go to the mall. I haven't been to this mall in a little minute. This is Tyson's. If you ever come to the DMV, Tyson's like a really big mall that everybody really goes to honestly it's cool at first like but since i live here i just feel like every mall here is trash because i've been to them a million times but it's not that bad of a store i mean not that bad of a mall honestly all right i'm in h&m looking because i saw a really cute mannequin over there that had this like knit dress on it but i can't find it anywhere over here this kind of looks like it but it's not really it that is kind of cute. This is the mannequin right here. I just love this like situation. I don't know. I just like the V-neck and then also it's split on the side. Well, I think I found it. This would be kind of cute. I feel like that would just be cute. Like a loose, graceful looking situation with like some strappy heels or something. Or maybe even like a gold belt, like a gold chain belt around it. All right, I'm in Zara now. 
trying to find some stuff to wear. This is such a pretty color. I'm looking for a specific thing, but they have so much more stuff in here than on the website. I'm back and I'm so happy to be back. Oh my gosh, like, <sighs> sometimes I just hate like going outside to be honest. Like going out in public, it's just, it's draining. So on Netflix, I have actually been watching The Circle, which I told you guys about The Circle a long time ago, but they finally came out with another um, like season. So let me go ahead and watch that one, eating my dinner. Let me show you my dinner real quick. Oh my God, my floor looks disgusting. Let me vacuum. When you have natural light in your apartment, it's really gonna show all the dust all the dust all the dirt on the floor on the counter all that i walked in my counter looked okay so i was like okay i'm not going to freak out but literally looking at my floor right now it's like whoa vacuum all right so let me show you all what i got for dinner i got tons of stuff actually i need to open it that looks good girl Ooh. Okay, and they label it all nice. What's this? That's a lot of fucking sushi, oh my God. I didn't know it came with that much. All right, so this is the dragon roll. I didn't know it was that many, oh my gosh. I guess that's why it was so expensive. This is spicy tuna. This is yellowtail. And also this is real crab and then we get the little soy sauce and stuff. So usually this would come on a like plate and it's like basically yellowtail sashimi, but they had to put it in here cause it was to, for it to go. And then of course the ginger, soy sauce. I don't really eat wasabi, but I love the ginger. Hey y'all, so it is Thursday, the kind of like second-ish day of the birthday prep because I didn't vlog on Tuesday or Wednesday. So yeah, also I braided my hair just for today cause I wanted to get some pictures in before I get my hair done because I'm gonna wanna keep my hair, you know, laid and slayed for the longest. So I wanted to like switch up my style. So yesterday I flexi rod my hair. If you follow me on Instagram, you already seen that girl, okay? But um, yeah, today I braided my hair cause I wanna take a couple pictures just around the house because I get my hair done tomorrow. I'm so excited. I miss my hairstyle. I was like, girl, I missed you so much for real. Like I need my hair done, okay? Um, in about an hour, I'm gonna get my nails done. And then after that, I'm gonna get my toes done. I'm going to a different um, person than, that does my toes. Okay, so I got a package from Kiss Colors, a little PR package. Let's open it together and see what it's getting. <gasps> Ooh. This is cute. Is this like skincare? I didn't know they had skincare. Y'all, look at this. Whoa, this looks so cute. Shout out to Kiss Colors for sending this over. I was like really shocked when they emailed me and sent me that they wanted to wanted me to be on their like PR list. And I was like, me? For real me? This is literally my first PR list, y'all. My first one ever, believe it or not. Yes. Everything is packaged so nicely. There's like tons of stuff in here. What's this? A aloe soothing gel. Oh my God, yes. Cause I'm trying to hit the pool. Our pool is actually not open. Well, I don't know when it's opening, but why is this not focusing? Camera, girl, come on now. You got this. I, I believe in you. I believe in you. There we go. This is like a little aloe thing that you can like pop in your purse when you have like sunburn and stuff. Um, organic Japanese matcha, ooh. A little matcha packet, I have to make this. This right here is, oh my God, I love this honey. A little mini honey packet. This is one of my favorite honeys that I use. Oh, a little ACV shot. So they also sent over their ancient Mayan Indian clay mask and oh I love this I used to use Indian clay mask all the time when my skin was just acting crazy or oh, they gave me another matcha thing so that is definitely gonna be put to use I can't wait to try it out so yeah kiss actually has skincare which is crazy so definitely 
go cop well i'll actually tell you guys how i feel about it and then you can go you know get your stuff but yeah let's get into what i got from trader joe's because i got some more stuff because i'm about to juice y'all see my bottles right here i actually got this from amazon i didn't want to do plastic this time um the last time i did like smoothies and stuff if you follow me like from I would say like two years ago then i used to have plastic bottles kind of like this they didn't really look like this but they serve the same purpose um i got those also off of amazon so i'll link these in my amazon store down below and yeah if you want to have a plastic free home like i desire to there you go all right trader joe's haul what is going on i got some more vegan like onion dip i got tons of apples like tons of them because i use them in my juice another another oh wait another one. Oh, there's another one how many did i get another apple and then i just got a bunch of celery um i will say that it does matter where you get your celery from because you can't just get any type of celery or it's going to be nasty as juice i'm just gonna say that like i feel like the celery from like the higher end grocery store not higher end because trader joe's is not really high end but i don't know like the more organic e type stores like not your safeway not your giant not your harris teeter not your kroger not none of that like i go get my celery from either whole foods wegmans or trader joe's that's it so yeah i got four of those because i already have one in the fridge and then of course I got myself some flowers so i want to do another flower arrangement because my other one it looked cute when the flowers weren't bloomed yet but when they bloomed it just was a hot ass mess so i got some different kind of flowers this time and i'm gonna try to make it smells so good i'm gonna try to make another flower arrangement so i'll probably do that maybe when i get back so i don't think i have enough time to do it before i get my nails done all right i'm about to start juicing this juicer is from amazon it's by the brand ai cook um, I got this so long ago, so I don't know if it's still available, but I will link it in my Amazon store so that you guys, you know, have the link to it. Hey y'all, so I just got back from getting my nails done. I also ate a little something something. So I've been in the house for a little bit, but let me show y'all my nails. They look so good. Oof. Okay, like, mm. Really quick, I wanna give a shout out to Nail Addict LA for sending over these gel polishes. So as you can see, I have these marble green tips and y'all, they are so 
beautiful like beautiful my nail tech did such a good job they look so natural like oh they just look so good so the colors that they sent over is underground queen this one is second chance they also sent over royal green and wonderland so these are the colors right here and then they also sent over these as well which i think i'm going to use for my next set i want to do like a yellowish kind of theme this one is called naked and famous and it's just like this really pretty creamy nude color this one is paradise fiesta so very springy summery so pretty and then this one is called you're a beauty so it's just like a deeper version of this one let me show you guys the comparison so yeah really pretty it kind of looks the same on camera but it's definitely a deeper version so i knew i wanted like greenish tones on my nails i didn't know the design i didn't know really what i wanted i didn't want to go like too deep because green can get very deep green is actually my favorite color by the way just in case you were wondering but um green can get very deep so i didn't want it to be too dark i definitely wanted it to be more like springy and bright so i'm glad she mixed in some white with this y'all i'm obsessed so if you're interested in this design and you want to get this design like this color and everything make sure you check out nail addict la they have some bomb gel polishes i've used them before i really love their no wipe top it's like perfect it's super shiny it's perfect like i really love them so definitely check them out also use my code i'll leave it up here so you guys can use it and save some money on your order usually when i go to the nail salon or something like that i usually take my own gel because i know exactly what color i want i don't want to go to the salon and then they don't have the exact color i want or anything like that so i always bring my own gels and it just it eliminates all my problems like i know exactly what i'm getting so yeah make sure you guys shop nail at la there's some really good stuff over there also i will leave my nail tech down below the girl that i went to she did such an amazing job like honestly i'm very surprised it literally looks like it's growing out of my fingernails like i don't even know like she just did such a good job usually like when i go to the nail salon and stuff like that she actually works out of her own place so she's not in a nail shop but usually when i go to other nail shops like they don't really prep your nail like she did like she just she paid attention to all the details and it literally looks like she paid attention to all the details like it's just completely flawless so yeah i'm trying to figure out what my next set is going to be i was actually thinking about these yellow tones that nail addict la sent me so i think i'm gonna do something with these next time i don't know like it's just giving me spring vibes like look at these beautiful colors so i think i might do something with these colors next time you guys will see all that in another vlog when i get my nails done again but um yeah so i have a pedicure appointment and it is in like an hour so i probably should start leaving now because it's not really that close to me so yeah i'm gonna go over there the girl who did my nails she actually recommended them to me she said they did pretty good pedicures i always get a gel pedicure with white gel all the time so i'm glad that she recommended that place hopefully they're good if they're not i'm gonna be mad but you know because I, I don't play by my toes now i don't play about the toes even though my toes not gonna be out wait why am i getting my toes done <laughs> i just realized that the shoes that i got for my birthday they're like a pointed toe so Okay, I'm back and I'm about to do this flower arrangement. I bought all these flowers at Trader Joe's earlier. I think I showed y'all. Technically, this is part of my birthday prep because I got these flowers for myself, you know? This is the um, space that I had the other ones in. I need to clean it out and not clean out when I first uh, dumped the water out. But this is from Ikea. So I got some baby breath. Also got, I don't know what this is. 
hydrangea. Ooh, okay. They look a little lint because I left them in the bag while I was gone all day. I didn't have them in water. And I also got green shamrock. Oh, pretty much a hydrangea, just a different like color. This one is like green and white. Oh, when I went to go get my nails done, I actually went to HomeSense and got a baking sheet. Um, I wanted a different baking sheet, but I really needed a baking sheet and I was not trying to wait until it came back in stock. So I just went and got that one. So yeah. Okay, so this one girl, she had put like tape on the vase. Should I do that? Like it made it stand up a lot better. So let's try it. I don't have the tape that she used. She used masking tape. All I got is packing tape. So we go use packing tape. Y'all, what am I doing? Cutting up tape and shit. <laughs> so she made like a little honeycomb design. Let's put one here. Okay. Maybe I should pull up a YouTube video. Y'all, I don't know. I'm just in here just looking crazy. Okay, we on to something. So this is what it looks like. Can y'all tell? It's like crisscross. Now let's do some surgery. So I need to cut these down. They look crazy because I didn't put them in water. I probably should have filled it up with water first. Girl. <laughs> and also someone in my last video, uh, she brought it to my attention that um, I didn't quite mention how to cut flowers. So you have to cut it at like a 45 degree angle. So I didn't mention that in the video, but that's what I was doing in the video. And it just helps your flowers last longer. It helps them drink more water. Is that like a good length? Boom, boom. Oh, they not even standing up, sis. I'm gonna learn how to make a good flower arrangement, okay? We gonna learn. Cause I really love flowers and like, so don't I need to learn how to like, you know, you know? I just realized I could have used the leaves to like line the um inside. That would have been cute next time. We're gonna do that next time. This looks so sad because they're all like droopy and stuff, but hopefully they perk up by tomorrow morning. Okay, so now we gotta add the baby breath. So I don't know how the heck or where the heck I'm gonna put it, but we just gonna stick it everywhere. <laughs> oh my God, my tape is ripping y'all. Oh my gosh, maybe that's why she used masking tape and not fucking packing tape. <sighs> Lord help me. Oh, this is hard. Shout out to all my florists. Cause I don't know what the heck I'm doing. Okay, I don't know. It look crazy. Okay, okay, I'm gonna keep working on it. I'm gonna keep working on it, but we gonna uh, check back in with you later because my camera's dying. So yeah, if I give up, I'll see you tomorrow. I'm done and this is what it looks like. It still kind of looks crazy, but I'm gonna show y'all tomorrow once the flowers kind of perk back up and stuff. Because again, like I said, I left it in the bag, not in water or anything. So they just need to liven up a little bit and then I feel like it'll look pretty good, but the baby's breath is like nice and flowy. Not flowy, <laughs> fluffy. So yeah, and even I put the some of the leaves, y'all probably can't see that, but I put some of the leaves at the bottom of the vase and I feel like it looks so cute. Good morning, it is, what's today? What's today? Friday. Um, I just got the shower, I'm about to, get dressed it's like 7 17. so i got this package from adidas and it's their pharrell collection i'm really excited to see Ooh, look at this this is the stuff that i got from the adidas and pharrell collection so it is his human race let me show y'all the logo it looks like this so bomb this stuff is such good quality like just feeling it it just feels amazing so this one right here is like a gray sweatshirt the material is amazing and then also the gray shorts Ooh, i love the back part it says adidas right here 
yeah just pockets on the side they are zipper pockets wow this is nice okay so nice and then the black set i actually got a t-shirt sweatpants and also a hoodie just because i actually don't have a black sweatsuit a black matching sweatsuit so i wanted to go ahead and grab one and then always a black tee is you know nice to have so i got that and of course human race on the chest area this material is amazing oh my gosh then we have the sweatpants and hopefully they're long enough again i'll try them on in the try on and let you guys know and yeah they just feel so good same detail with the pocket like a little zipper pocket and then on the back we have two pockets here's the black hoodie it actually doesn't have strings which i thought it would have or does it no it doesn't that's okay that's different i got a medium in literally everything so i got a medium in everything all of them say human race here the hoodie of course just a regular hoodie and y'all this material i cannot get over it in the nude set y'all already know i had to get a nude one so i just went ahead and got the nude t-shirt because i do have some nude hoodies that i didn't really need another one so i went ahead and got the t-shirt the material guys as i'm feeling it i'm just like wow i'm literally blown away and i love the branding so nice and then for the nude set i do have some nude joggers so i went ahead and got some nude shorts from them also in a medium everything is in a medium so yeah shout out to adidas they partner with magic links and they gifted me these and i am so excited because i just love good quality basics you guys already know i rave about my basics and how i like them and all that good stuff so yeah i'm definitely going to be wearing these all the time guys look at my flowers they finally look alive and well all they needed was to just you know be put in some water and i also put some of the flower food as well in there um but this is a better look at how i like wrapped so pretty they look so good i love these ones also i need to mount my tv apparently you can do this one yourself i got this off of amazon maybe i can put that in a vlog and y'all can see me struggle but um i'm about to head out i think i'm just gonna grab breakfast from like starbucks or something because it's just on the way and i don't have time to um make breakfast so yeah all right i'm done in there i am now fully blank blank so yes i'm really excited i feel good um i'll probably show you guys more in like my birthday vlog how like it affected me and stuff because i'm probably going to end my birthday prep here just because i want to get this up at a certain time all right on my way to get my hair done it's windy as shit outside Ooh. hey boo hi i brought the main yes how are you <laughs> good how are you good just you know prepping for my birthday yes when is it when's it may 4th yes ma'am so yeah i'm excited yes yeah her birthday is today so oh she's doing the nails and the chorus i know i did all that and yesterday and i was like oh. okay Girl, you know, I've been trying all right, I know that's to right. get this content, <laughs> but it ain't, been, it ain't been too successful. Oh, what's been happening? Girl, it's a struggle. Okay, I'm going through it. Okay. Are you excited for today? Yes, I'm ready for another round of greatness. Yes. So how, how did everything go the first time? It was good. Like, my hair was feeling all right. It was a little dry, but I uh -huh. used the... Um, Olaplex. The Olaplex oil, and it was good. fine. Yeah, yeah. That's I had some like brightness, so you probably see some parts. But I know this yeah. is perfect. This is perfect. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I'm thinking we could add some more platinum pieces. Mm-hmm. Cause I have some right here, like on the sides. Yeah. So I want it to be like this more throughout, and then I know you want that money shot. Yeah. In the front, so we gonna do that. But I definitely want to go higher up in the front. Okay. So you want to go higher up. Yeah, like on the front, the whole front part, like, I guess this area to be oh, higher. Oh, when you like put it up in a ponytail. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. when it grew out a little bit, it was given like highlighted ponytail and like a little bit up here. Oh, yeah. And I was like, I want more like right there. All in the front. Yes. Your nails look good too. Thank you. See, these are pretty. I was yes. a girl I found on Instagram. It was like really clean. And yes, like, she did her thing. She prepped the nails. She did all that good stuff. Yes. You know them little nail salons don't be doing they that. They don't. Thing. 
That's why a lot of stuff. They slap work some like acrylic this. on and go. Exactly. They don't work over other people's work or none of that. Yeah, she don't work on other people's work either. That's good. Which I understand. Yeah, because their process is different in the materials. The she brand. yeah, she don't use tips, she like sculpts them. Oh, so that's like straight acrylic? Yeah. They look so she, clean and so She clean. was like, she was, imp I was, she was blowing my mind. I was talking to her, I was like getting to know her. She's so nice. Aww. That's so, 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 so good. Yeah. And that's talent right there. Cause no, you literally. Cause she's one of those two girls. Like, look at this. She drew this all by her, like her though. She's an artist. Literally. That so pretty. And I love how the cuticle looks. No. It's like oh all my the God. details. Like your nails clean. looking good, but like every person looks consistent. shower cap because we didn't know if it was raining outside or not but y'all look at my hair it is beautiful 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 like I went a little higher this time so as you can see they kind of go higher before they were kind of lower and then we did some like money pieces in the front so when I have like my hair up and then I have like my two little pieces Ooh, okay she also toned some of it and then also kept some like just you know the different tones like she made it super dimensional I don't know if you can see that oh I'm obsessed and then we just did the same thing like I did basically a blowout and then she curled me a little bit and then took the pin curls out like immediately so it gave like this loose just giving the hair like body not necessarily like curling it I just love her little technique so I'm about to head home and I will see y'all when I get home I'm so tired like I was in there yawning back to back just dog tired so I don't know what I'm about to eat for dinner I literally haven't eaten anything today like I need to eat before I pass out all right I'm back and I guess you can kind of see my hair a little better so yeah this camera is really good in low lighting but i really feel like it's just dark as hell outside but here's what we are working with i'm pretty sure you can see like the dimension like the lighter pieces and then the front parts are like almost platinum and then throughout here you can kind of see all the dimension and stuff that she added so yes really really good a bomb ass blowout the ends look really don't mind that that is my poshmark pile but um the ends she did give me another trim so my ends are like super fresh and 
like really healthy looking. Let me show you the other side. So yeah, looks real good. And I'm excited. I really feel super cute. So yeah, um, that's pretty much it for this birthday vlog. I mean, not birthday, ooh, birthday prep vlog because I literally want to lay down because I don't know if it's like the shot or what, but I'm tired, so. Or maybe it's because I was like sitting in that chair for so freaking long. I was there for, I wanna say like four hours damn near. So yeah, I'm tired. No, I was there for five hours actually. So yeah, five hours, but honestly I have a million inches of hair, which I'm grateful for. But like girl, sometimes it just don't be like, it just takes forever to do, is all I'm saying. So yeah, it took forever, but I'm super satisfied. And you know, we were having girl talk and stuff, and also one of her friends came, and then we were having other like girl talk and stuff like that. She's a business owner, so we were having kind of like business talk. It was really fun. Like the hair salon is really, really fun. Even though she has her own, like it's just her in there. Um, we still always have like such a good like girl talk. It's literally the hair salon experience with just like you and another person. So yeah, I was enjoying it. That's probably why I forgot to pick up the camera and vlog when she was like actually straightening my hair and blow drying my hair and all that. But if you wanna see how she flat irons and blow dries and stuff my hair, you guys can watch my hair transformation video or new hair vlog or whatever the heck I called it. It's on my channel. I'll link it up here so you guys can watch it. Um, but yeah, there I did the whole entire process of what she did to my hair. Um, and this time she just pretty much did the same exact thing. She actually cut some layers in the front so that my front wouldn't be so flat. And then next time I go, I think I'm going to get layers all over. So yeah, hair looking bomb. Y'all know that's my girl. Like, I love her so much. She's actually not accepting any new clients. So... I would say just follow her and then wait until she is so you can get in there so that next time she's not accepting new clients, it's okay because you're already a client so you can get on that list and get your hair done by my sis Famada. So yeah, I like literally cannot stop touching my hair, but I'm about to put it up in like one big bun and then tomorrow it'll literally fall just like this, maybe even a little more like a very loose curl. So, ooh. I'm excited. Look at all of my like dimension though. This is literally crazy. Like look at that. Oh wow. That's crazy. Look at all of that. Y'all I'm hype. I'm hype. Okay so I'm about to go y'all. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. This birthday maintenance vlog. I'm about to go lay the down okay i ordered food because i'm not cooking nothing okay i'm tired and technically at this point it's my birthday so i deserve to eat out okay so i don't want to hear nobody clocking me now it's my birthday and i'm gonna do what i want to do so so i love you guys so much and thank you for tuning in and stay tuned for the birthday vlog because it's gonna be real cute real lit all of that okay i love you guys and i'll see you guys in my next video peace